Hi, this is Kerry, and welcome to another two minute tip. Today we're going to talk about compass calibration. Now, this is going to work for both the Inspire 1 and the Phantom 3 series. Uh, when we're out in the field, we want to do a compass calibration anytime that we've changed our location by more than like 50 to 75 miles. What we're doing is we are orienting the aircraft to the Earth's magnetic declination. So this is going to help it to fly straight and to hold level and not move when it's in a hover. If you see that it's starting to hook a little bit, it's time to do a compass calibration. Anytime we do a firmware update, we're going to do an IMU calibration and then a compass calibration. So you shouldn't have to do it too often if you're flying in the same place all the time, but when we move from one location to another, it may be time to do a compass calibration. Now the way we're going to do that is we're going to tap on the colored bar at the top. We're going to tap on calibrate, say OK, and it's going to tell us what to do. And all we're going to do is we're going to rotate the aircraft 360 degrees until the lights on the back turn green. Go nose down, rotate it 360 degrees until we get a double flash of green on the back. And now our aircraft is calibrated for the compass. It's really just that easy. And you want to make sure that we do it whenever it tells us to or whenever we change location by a significant distance. So that's all there is to it. Again, this will work for the Phantom 3 series or the Inspire 1. This has been Kerry with Multicopter Warehouse. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you next time. Bye bye.